Montreal's mayor is standing by his embattled police chief. There have been calls for Philippe Pichet to step aside temporarily over the scandal involving the surveillance of journalists. But the mayor says if that were to happen before all the facts are known, it would be a public lynching. Derek Conlon reports. The pressure on the police chief to step aside temporarily has been mounting, but the mayor reiterated that Philippe Pichet still has his full confidence. If you made something and you say, no, I didn't do it, Am I going to lynch you publicly? La Presse reported Saturday it obtained sealed court documents showing police got warrants to electronically surveil Patrick Lagasse and another La Presse reporter. They obtained a warrant to uh, intercept our conversation. And when I say our conversation, it's not only me, but Vincent Larouche, one of my fellow reporters. But the mayor says he won't take any action before the city's Public Security Commission issues a report and Montreal Inspector General Denis Galland conducts his own investigation with a soon-to-be-appointed judge. If during that time we're having uh, all those facts, we will be able to, uh, to, take, uh, to take factual decision. The opposition at City Hall says that's not good enough. There is a crisis of confidence among Montrealers uh, toward their police force, uh, and uh, Mr. Coderre doesn't seem to realize this. And Norris says the prudent course of action is for Pichet to step down for the time being. Pending the outcome of that commission of inquiry, we believe that uh, Mr. Pichet should step aside. Earlier in the week, the police chief said the force never eavesdropped electronically on Lagasse. He was asked if other reporters had been under surveillance. Not uh, from what I know right now. A position he reiterated in a written statement on Saturday. The SPVM did wiretap officers who were the subject of an investigation, but no other person apart from the officers was part of the electronic surveillance, but a position he later nuanced. Of course, anyone in contact with the police officers could be heard in conversations. Public Security Minister Martin Coitou took to Twitter on the weekend to say, Montreal police authorities and the city of Montreal must demonstrate the highest level of transparency in this file and take measures to restore the confidence of Montrealers in their institutions. And according to the police chief, those steps are being taken. He wrote that on Monday, police will make a written request to the court to speed up the legal process of unsealing records scheduled for November 24th to demonstrate our transparency. But the pressure on Pichet is substantial with the PQ, Projet Montréal and the Police Brotherhood all calling on him to step aside temporarily. Derek Conlon, CTV News. And at that mayor's press conference today, Denis Coderre announced Richard Bergeron is joining his party. Bergeron is the former leader of opposition party Projet Montréal. He left the party he founded in 2014. Bergeron then joined Coderre's executive committee but remained sitting as an independent in the Saint-Jacques.